All right, YouTube, this is 2019 Ram Rebel, how to install trailer brakes. If it doesn't come with um, come with the trailer brakes, this is a quick, uh, easy uh, solution to not going to the dealership. So what you wanna do is go to infotainment.com. That's where I found the trailer brake for my Ram Rebel uh, 2019. So you get the module, you get the bracket, you get the OBD thing that flashes your, whatever you call it, your computer. You get your uh, security bypass override. There's instructions, the QR code. This is real quick and simple. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get all that in and then hang on, we're gonna go to part two. Okay, so part two, I'm kind of doing this at night. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take, this is real quick and easy. There's other videos on how to do it. You're gonna take your whole entire dash off. I know it's kind of big and scary. Take the two screws out there and just rip it back yeah i know it's kind of scary rip it back take this piece out right here there's two screws on the back side take them out put this in be careful putting this in this is the what comes with it the brake module from the factory whatever you want to call it so there it is pop that back in and then there's going to be a wire on the back side that plugs into this there's the wire is already pre-wired for um this truck and i think every ram truck so 2019 Ram Rebel right here. Plug it in, pop this dash back in. Now I'm making this real quick and easy. The next part is you're gonna take your whole piece off right here, whatever you wanna call it. And then up under here, this is where you're gonna install your module. See, right there, screws. And then you're gonna put those two wires in. But before you do that, you're gonna, what you're gonna do is you're gonna get the security bypass thing. There's, look at the QR instructions. It's gonna tell you right up. Let's see, where's it at? Hang on, this is kinda hard to see. I'm sorry. So see these two right here, these two cables? Take those out, plug them into your security bypass, turn your car on to run, and then, Put your OBD flash thing in there and wait for it to turn green. When it turns green, take the OBD flash thing out. Take your, these wires that you plugged into security bypass, plug them back into here and you're good to go. But once all that's said and done, hook those wires in there. So if you need a recap, don't put these into the last step. Do the security bypass. Like I said, they have instructions on how to do this and you don't have to watch all my crazy camera angles. Put these security bypass, flash the computer or whatever you want to call it, and then hook the wires in the module. And so I'm not going to turn the truck on. I know I'm probably making y'all sick. But when you do turn the truck back on, you're all good to go. It's gonna show all your factory trailer settings on your screen and everything like that, and you're done, that's it. So, hang on. So instead of you going to the dealership, I got quoted, I think $800 to do the whole setup that includes the module, flashing the computer, whatever. Go to infotainment, get the whole setup. They have all the instructions on the website there and follow them, save you a lot of money. Probably voiding some kind of warranty, I'm not sure whatever who doesn't void a warranty so that's it it seems to be working great for me like i said just put this in a 2019 ram rebel it didn't come with it factory i guess just because i don't know i don't know why i didn't have it, it kind of aggravated me but um seems to be working just fine like i said here's your security bypass those two wires that i told you up underneath your steering wheel plug those in there then do your OBD thing. It's going to be blue and it'll turn green. Your horn will honk when it's good to go. They have instructions right here. Infotainment.com. I'm not sponsored by them, but good stuff on there. They have all the instructions on the website. Just figured I'd make a quick and easy video on how to do it. Probably the hardest part is mounting that damn bracket up underneath here. Those screws were kind of a pain in the ass for me. So, um, and I did it at 10 o'clock at night. If I can do it, anybody can do it. If you have any questions, comments, or whatever, let me know. See ya, thanks.